with Chai Master. This video will walk you through the steps to connect your system to the internet. All advanced experience systems are designed to work with a constant internet connection. This allows for automatic updates and is required to access the smartphone remote control and our management website, Chime Center. At the bottom of the Network Settings page is an option that is used only when no internet connection is available at your facility. If this is your situation, go to our video on setting up the local access point instead of continuing with this video. If you are able to access the internet via an Ethernet or Wi-Fi connection, Make sure this setting stays set to normal. If this mode is changed, you will be prompted to restart the system. A physical Ethernet connection is the most reliable. Plug in an Ethernet cable directly from your router to the back of the system using the port labeled LAN. Make sure the wireless antenna is not plugged in. After a moment, this connection will be recognized automatically. If your advanced experience system is used in a location where it cannot be physically connected, you can log in to your building's Wi-Fi instead. Before you begin a Wi-Fi connection, make sure an internet connected network is available. If you use this network on your phone and can perform a search in your browser without using data, that network is connected to the internet. You will also need to know the case sensitive password for the network you will use. Finally, you'll need the provided Wi Fi adapter antenna. Snugly screw the two parts of the antenna together and power down the system before plugging it in. To do that, tap and hold the gold power light until it turns red. It will flash through some different colors as it powers down, and when it comes to a solid blue light, plug in the antenna to the top right USB port on the back of the AX system. Make sure an Ethernet cable is not already plugged in. Restart the system by tapping the blue light. When the light is solid gold again, you can continue. From the home screen, tap Settings, then tap Network. Tap the arrow beside Wi-Fi Networks to see the list of available options. A padlock beside a network indicates that it will require a password. Tap on your network name and, if prompted, enter the Wi-Fi password using the on-screen keyboard. Then tap Connect. Once your network is connected, this screen will show a settings gear beside it. If you tap on the gear, you'll see details of your network and an option to disconnect. Tap close to get back to the main network page. At the top of the screen under network settings, you will see the status connected to internet. Once you've confirmed that the connection was successful, you can exit the screen by tapping the Chime Master name or home in the top toolbar. As long as you have a good, stable connection, 
This process will not need to be repeated. In addition to the connection status on the network page, you can also view the system's network status on the login screen where you are prompted to enter your PIN. Access that screen now by tapping the padlock icon in the top toolbar, then tap the clock screen. On this page, a check mark on the globe under the top toolbar indicates a current network connection. An X indicates no connection. A P indicates that it's in access point mode. Both Ethernet and Wi-Fi network connections have the option in the network menu to enable advanced network setup. In most cases, these options will not be needed and a standard network connection will suffice. Turning on Advanced Network Setup will allow you to set your system to use a static IP address. Look below for more videos and learn how to use all the features enhanced by this connection. Thank you for watching this Chime Master video.